Good Monday. This is Jay Brew, co-chairman of Seafried and Brew. Enterprise Risk Management. This is the second in our series of three webcasts talking about the slides that Jimmy Sawyer of Sawyer and Jacobs had at their Bank Tech Summit here recently in Memphis, Tennessee, where I spoke with Jimmy about enterprise risk management. And I think that his slides were so very important. Whether or not you have ERM in place in your bank or considering it or looking at it into the future is that this particular assessment that Jimmy does is vital. It's then added in with the Seafried and Brew total risk index and all of its components so that the bank can have their arms around this whole ERM situation in a way that is cost effective. But one of the things that Jimmy talks about is ERM misconceptions in the context of community banking, and that's important because you need to you look at ERM as community banking ERM, that enterprise risk management is not. Taking all the bank specific regulatory mandated risk assessments like BSA and putting them in a pile or combining them into one massive risk assessment, that's not what this is all about. What I talked about last week in the web first webcast was talking about what keeps me up at night as a community bank director. And when you look at it from the standpoint of risk, that one has to look at it in many different ways, not just from what the regulators are mandating. In the context is not an audit risk assessment. So once again, it moves as part of that audit risk assessment, but it has to go very far beyond that. And it's not just an asset liability management exercise, because those are other risks that you're looking at, and you have to take in a more global perspective. It's not applying a generic risk framework designed for large publicly traded corporations. Once again, it has to be geared for a community bank in terms of the risks that it's taking. And it's not a process that never reaches a conclusion. So when we look at it is that we have to look at this as an ongoing basis. Also, it's not an exact science and it's not a one and done exercise so that it has to be a continuum in terms of t looking at this risk and monitoring it on an ongoing basis. But it's not tactical. It has to be strategic thought. So let's go through Jimmy's list of what ERM is. A high level, bank-wide process, purposefully broad in scope. Once again, like we said, strategic in terms of its outlook and its effect on the institution. It's a process where audit can test the bank's mitigating controls but should not drive the ERM program. And that is really key because when we look at it from an audit perspective where it does have a place is that we're broadening our scope. It is linked to asset liability management concepts but covers much more and at a higher level. And it is specific to the business of banking, I would say to the business of community banking. And that's why it's so different from what a large bank might go through in terms of their overall ERM. So it has to fit your institution and be a situation where once again it not only satisfies the regulators, satisfies your auditors, satisfies the board, and it must satisfy the management team. It is a process that documents a risk response or decision. It is oftentimes more of an art than a science, inexact but necessary and beneficial an ongoing process of annual enterprise risk assessment and quarterly risk performance monitoring, 
which we take care of with the Seafreed and Brew Total Risk Index. Looking at that, we've talked about that before in terms of setting event triggers, putting those into place so that once again, a community bank can be proactive in terms of managing their risk instead of reactive. And finally, it comes back to where we were in the beginning, that it is strategic. And in those type of strategic thinking, that we can make our strategic plan work, and we know what risks we're taking, what risks we've accepted, and we can make the strategic plan successful. So what we did is that we included Jimmy's slides from this presentation. Uh, as part of this particular webcast so that you can go through his presentation, look at all of these, and review it in terms of your own position on ERM. This is Jay Brew, co-chairman of Seafreed and Brew. Have a great week.